some interesting information and facts about our solar system and its planets. Our solar system formed 4.6 billion years ago. Our solar system consists of the star, sun, eight planets, six dwarf planets, and 181 moons. The space may smell like a metallic aroma, welding fumes. Our whole solar system orbits the inner edge of our Milky Way galaxy. We are moving at an average velocity of 828,000 kilometers per hour. But even at that high rate, it still takes us about 230 million years to make one complete orbit around the Milky Way. The Sun is a hot glowing ball of hydrogen and helium. The Sun produces its energy using nuclear fusion, meaning it fuses hydrogen atoms into helium to create enormous amounts of energy. The temperature on the surface is 5,505 degrees Celsius. Solar storms occur when the Sun emits huge bursts of energy in the form of solar flares which may damage satellites, power infrastructure, and radio communications, they do not harm people. Mercury is the smallest planet in the solar system, right next to the Sun. The Sun's gravitational field is so high on Mercury, that it takes 58 days and 15 hours to complete one rotation. Mercury has the maximum temperature fluctuations in the solar system. Mercury's poles are ice likewise Earth's, and its entire surface has been mapped. Mercury has got an enormous iron core. Venus is the brightest planet in the solar system. One day on Venus is longer than an Earth year. Venus has the uniqueness that it spins clockwise, opposite to all the other planets. Even though Mercury is closer to the Sun, Venus is the hottest planet in our solar system. Its thick atmosphere is full of carbon dioxide and sulfuric acid clouds. Venus has 90 times the atmospheric pressure of Earth. Earth is the only planet with oxygen and water where life or humans can thrive. Our planet's core is as hot as the surface of the Sun. Oxygen, silicon, aluminum, and iron account for 88.1% of the mass of the Earth's crust. The Earth's atmosphere extends to a distance of 10,000 kilometers. The Earth's molten iron core creates a magnetic field. Earth's crust, called the lithosphere, consists of 15 to 20 moving tectonic plates. Mars is called the red planet because of all the iron in the soil. Mars may look warm but it's very cold. Mars can have huge dust storms that last for months and cover the entire planet. It's been predicted that 4 billion years ago, Mars lost its magnetic field that left the planet vulnerable to the solar wind, which clawed away the atmosphere and allowed the water to sputter into space. Ceres takes 1,682 Earth days, or 4.6 Earth years, to make one trip around the Sun. The Dawn spacecraft reached Ceres in 2015 to study its surface, composition, and history. The word serial comes from the same name. Jupiter is a gas giant and the largest planet in the solar system. Jupiter has four rings and up to 80 moons. The star-sized planet is almost all gas of hydrogen and helium. A day in Jupiter is about 10 hours. Ganymede and Callisto are the two big moons of Jupiter that are even bigger than Mercury in size. Jupiter acts as a solar system's vacuum cleaner because of its powerful gravity, attracting many comets and asteroids to hit it rather than other planets. Saturn could float in water as it is full of gases. It is famous for its beautiful rings, made of ice and rock. Satellites like Enceladus and Titan, home to internal oceans, it is assumed that they could support life. Saturn has 83 moons where 63 moons are confirmed and named, 
and another 20 moons are to be confirmed and named by the International Astronomical Union. Some rings are the size of a house. Uranus is the coldest planet in the solar system. Once every 84 Earth years, Uranus will revolve around the Sun. Uranus's axis is tilted almost 98 degrees which looks like it is spinning horizontally. Oberon and Titania are the largest among the 27 moons of Uranus. Uranus is so massive that 63 Earths can fit inside. The pressures inside Uranus are enormous at those temperatures and would crush life. Neptune is the smallest of the gas giants. In 2011 Neptune completed its first 165-year orbit since its discovery in 1846. Like Jupiter and Saturn, Neptune's atmosphere is composed primarily of hydrogen and helium, along with traces of hydrocarbons and possibly nitrogen. Neptune is predominantly blue due to the absorption of red and infrared light by the methane in the atmosphere. A study has found that diamond rain may be more common on ice giant planets like Neptune and Uranus than previously thought. The Kuiper Belt was discovered in 1992 and named after astronomer Gerard Kuiper. Around 35,000 Kuiper Belt objects are estimated to be larger than 100 kilometers in diameter. The Kuiper Belt is so huge that it could take 30,000 years to fly past it. The Pluto, Eris, Haumea, and Makemake dwarf planets reside in this belt. Pluto was officially reclassified as a dwarf planet in 2006 by International Astronomical Union because it does not have the dominant gravitational body in its orbit around the Sun. It was named Pluto by an 11-year-old girl inspired by Disney's Pluto Dog. Pluto has an elliptical orbit that's not in the same plane as the eight official planets orbits. Haumea is a unique, elongated, unusual shape, apart from your typical spherical dwarf planets. Haumea has one of the shortest days in the entire solar system and takes 3.9 hours for a full rotation. Haumea is named after the Hawaiian goddess and has two moons. Makemake is located in the Kuiper Belt, a donut-shaped region of icy bodies beyond the orbit of Neptune. Makemake has one moon and lacks its expected atmosphere for life to exist. Makemake is very similar in appearance to Pluto, but it is much redder. Eris is one of the largest known dwarf planets in our solar system. It's about the same size as Pluto but is three times farther from the Sun. Eris and its moon Dysnomia were the most distant known natural objects in the entire solar system. RR245 is a new dwarf planet discovered in the outer solar system on 9th of September 2015 by Michelle T. Bannister. This dwarf planet measures approximately 600 kilometers in diameter and may have a moon that needs to be confirmed by International Astronomical Union.